I'm very disturbed about what I read in the Slater newspaper regarding myself and the Marshall Democrat News. I am too because I'm, I'm, I'm very, very concerned, concerned about it. what I read in the newspaper regarding the last public meeting. Mm -hmm. It states, Jeffries questioned how'd they get the minutes, referring to the Marshall newspaper. If Marshall Democrat News had the executive minutes, they had to make them up because I didn't give them to them, Jeffries replied. The next paragraph states Ms. Standers saying, unless someone didn't turn the minutes into me. First, I really don't understand what that means, why each member would have minutes to turn in. One person's responsible for drawing this up and keeping track of the All entire meeting. All meetings have to be turned back in after they've been approved. Standard procedure. Standard procedure. One person, what I'm saying is, mm -hmm. one person takes notes at those meetings. Yes. Okay. And that was a possibility because I didn't pay attention how many came back. Because okay. I wasn't, yeah, okay. I wasn't in charge. I well, didn't think I was responsible for that. But, okay, thank yeah. you. Um, mm -hmm. To get to my first point, I would like anybody who did have questions after that was mentioned in the meeting to know that I do have copies of my request for several meeting minutes that I faxed here. I have copies of the meeting minutes that came back to me via fax with cover sheets from, from Ms. Jeffries. Some of those meeting minutes have Ms. Sanders' name on them. If those minutes are not correct, I need to know so I can correct my story. If they are correct, I have a question of why the board questioned it to begin with. Because those are public record mm -hmm. and there's, there's really no necessary reason for them to wonder why they're printed in the paper. It's a routine thing. We even did it today. Call the school board to follow up with the closed meeting because it's public record to know what motions were made, if any actions were taken, what the individual I, votes were. I think I can answer that question. Okay. I think it was from Jim Stanfield. I think he said that there was different information than what the local paper had received in the exec minutes. Okay. That's what I remember. And did anybody say... Yes, Sarah requested meeting minutes, and when she received them, the names of the board members voting were not in them, so she requested the correct minutes. Did somebody say that? No, but I do remember doing it. I do remember that happening. I am really disappointed okay. because of the way that conversation seems to have been conducted. Regardless of how I received public meeting minutes, if they were correct, it doesn't seem to me, like anybody stood up and said, well, that, that is how we voted, you know, regardless of how she received them and who sent them. That is how we voted. So, yes, Kathy, they were correct in this story. Sarah did not make up that story. Wait a minute. I don't recall. I said it. Did oh, Jerry okay. ask you? Yeah, I, I, I think there was a point made that, oh, yes. that it was different. <laughs> and Jim started out, it was different than what was in the Slater paper. But right. I... You know. Oh no, she questioned how she got copies of the she executive did. meeting. I, I remember. And that's she when Jerry made the statement how about it read. Read. Okay. I was here, I so that wasn't a correct moment. I, I don't want to go around. I'm sorry. Then I need correct meeting minutes. I'm the, only, the only copies you have are the correct ones. Okay, thank you. Uh -huh. The only other thing I want to say, because I also need to go, is I don't ever want my professional name or my newspaper name to be dragged through the mud like that again. If it happens, we will be having a new conversation. I do not want to feel like I need to be here to defend my newspaper. Okay. I think you're right. Thank you. You're absolutely right. So why did you say that, yes. Kathy? Why did you make that up? No, it's a valid question. 